An NCD or non-convertible debenture is essentially a debt instrument with a fixed tenure that pays a certain rate of interest monthly, quarterly, annually or at the end of a pre-specified tenure. Unlike debentures which can be exchanged for company stocks, non-convertible debentures cannot be converted. Also, since NCDs are non-convertible, they usually carry higher rates of interest as well. Let's compare NCDs with an equally safe instrument for investment, a bank fixed deposit. The first thing that stands out in favor of NCDs over a bank FD is surely the rate of interest it offers. While banks offer interest rates of 8.75% for fixed deposits, NCDs offer above 11% interest for the invested amount. Fixed deposits typically have a maturity period ranging from 1 year to 5 years. On the other hand, the average maturity periods for NCDs range from 90 days to as long as 10 or even 20 years. Though they are less liquid than most other investments like shares, debentures have much more liquidity than bank fixed deposits. You can sell debentures in the secondary markets before their maturity dates just like you would sell stocks. On the other hand, fixed deposits can be converted to cash before maturity, but the banks may charge a penalty for doing so. Buying and selling NCDs favors both the issuer of the NCD as well as the investor. The company issuing the NCD gets a loan without pledging its assets and the investors purchasing the debenture get large sums of interest for parting with their money. Number 1. Check the company's background. The most important thing you must consider is a detailed research on the company's background. Look for instances where the company has raised money in the past and whether or not it has met its obligations. Number 2. Check the credit rating. Investors usually go for NCDs due to the higher coupon rates. Ensure that the higher coupon rates are backed by top-notch credit ratings from independent rating agencies like ICRA, Crisil, or are backed by securities in the case of secured NCDs. Remember, if you are investing in unsecured NCDs, then you must consider whether your risk appetite and investment objectives permit you to invest in them. Number 3. Check the interest options to align them with your financial goals. NCDs are available with various options for interest payouts, with annual and cumulative payouts being the most common options. The cumulative option is most rewarding since the interest is reinvested and investors can benefit from compounding. The payout options are suitable for investors who prefer to receive regular incomes.